lovely Richwood, Ridgefield Park, New Jersey. My name is Ed Dooney. I'm a sales engineer at Vitech. The subject today is the portable broadcast transmission system offered by Vitech LCC. On the table, we have three different models of the unit. First of all, you have to think of this as an access point for broadcast type situations. We have our first unit is a single camera unit, which is 4K capable. It can be one kilometer from the end, end point if you want to provide power via the cable, or up to 10 kilometers remoted over SMP cable, providing local power to the unit. Next unit is a 500 unit. You'll notice the cards. In this particular unit, there are six slots. We have 17 different card choices available covering analog, digital, um, audio, intercom, and multiple data, and other cards, data cards. In this particular unit, we have three SDI, 3D channel cards. We have a uh, data, microphone, and a wireless audio card. This unit is connected by a SMP cable to a larger unit, which is the top of the line model of this series. This is a 2300L. It has 14 card slots. It's important to mention now that each of these card lots are interchangeable. Any of the various types of cards, whether it be audio, data, or digital, can be swapped out to any position at any time, depending on your needs. As I said, we have 14 slots in here. Currently, 10 of them are set up for SDI 3G HD cameras. We have a uh, audio out card and a data and another different audio card. Now how is this used? Typical installation that I've seen lately is they take the small unit, the 500, and they will remote it from the broadcast or production vehicle. The information then would be run back to the truck via SMP cable and currently into another PBTS unit. And from there, regular SDI cables will be hooked up to the patch panel of the broadcast truck. The, we also have down here a 19 inch rack with a SEMPI cable connector in the back and the breakout connections for the SDI cables in the front. So if you currently have a vehicle not set up to switch the type of unit, you bring it back via the SEMPI cable to a similar unit, break it out into your distribution camera, uh, panel. If in the future you build the 19-inch rack into the vehicle, the information can come in via the SEMPI cable right to the distribution panel and brought inside the van and then broken out to various monitors or switching systems. The units are uh, powered locally. We have local power, both AC and DC. The 12 volt DC power to the unit can be provided under one kilometer. Outside, beyond that point, you have to provide local power. In the larger unit, you'll notice we also have a monitor. And it has five additional 12 volt DC outputs and local power input. The system itself right now, the way we have it hooked up, we have a uh, Canon camera hooked through a bridge converter via HDMI from the camera, SDI cable into the 500 unit. Then out of the SEMPI cable to the 2300L, and then it's taken out of here through an Offit converter on the table, SDI to HDMI to the screen behind me. 
The beauty of the unit is its versatility. As I said, these cards can be reconfigured at, to meet any situation that you have. Uh, it's a perfectly ideal for a sports or an entertainment venue where you start with your access points and you can move, add, delete, or change the setup in a matter of minutes by just popping the card and putting a new one in. Um, the rugged case is a big deal in the field. The technicians that have used these on, on, on uh, shoots absolutely love the ruggedness of the Pelican case. Takes a beating. Uh, it's easy to transport and set up. We've had this thing installed in the field for well over a year now and we've not had one reported failure of any type. I guess at this point the thing to remember is this larger unit can actually in lieu of a broadcast truck for a budget situation this larger unit can actually serve as your broadcast point or station bringing in the cameras to this point viewing it on the screen and then taking it out for whatever purpose you want. So it can be standalone, daisy chained to itself, one way bi-directional, or into a full full up broadcast fan. Um, I don't know, is there any is there any questions? We have no questions. No questions? At this point, I don't know what else to say. <laughs> Oh yes, 4K, popular subject these days. This unit, the single unit, is 4K capable, and the 2300 L is also for no, 2300 unit is 4K capable. No questions. The information on this unit can be found on our website with all the uh, card options that are available. Hmm? Oh, yes, and we'll be at the uh, NAB show in uh, Las Vegas next week. Please come and visit us, booth 6514. But if you come to our website, all the information is available and feel free to call and ask any questions that you have. If there are no questions then, I thank you for your time. Thank you for tuning in. And from lovely Jersey, I wish you a good day.